there isn't anything in this world that you wouldn't do for them to find the person who did this. Tonight's big story, a Valley mom is begging for help in finding the man who killed her son on Christmas. That suspect killed Tyler Cardiel, an 18 year old saving up for a car with dreams of going to college. Good evening, I'm Tram Mai. And I'm Jodana Caribe and Mark are off tonight. At this hour, police need your help finding the guy who killed Tyler as his mother grieves. Team 12's William Pitts joins us with the heartbreaking details. Will? Take a look at these photos. This is who police are looking for, and they don't know who it is, but they say he shot and killed a teenager on Christmas morning. Please, anybody just help me get justice for my son. Christmas will never be the same for Monique Cardiel. He didn't deserve this, and there wasn't anything that he could have done that could have caused somebody to feel the need to do this to him. Her son Tyler walking home from an overnight shift at Circle K on Christmas morning. Tyler's family still asleep, presents sitting unopened. Tyler walked down 83rd Avenue near Glen Rosa, north of Indian School, when police say this man shot and killed him. It was just the, the greatest son, and he's got a younger brother at home who's completely devastated, and, and I don't even know how I'm supposed to be strong enough for him. Tyler was only 18. He graduated high school, got a job, and was saving for a car. He planned to go to college after the pandemic. I don't know if the suspect is a parent, if he has kids, but... Just imagine if one of yours was taken from you. There isn't anything in this world that you wouldn't do for them to find the person who did this. Police don't know exactly what happened, whether Tyler knew the shooter or why he opened fire. All they have is this video showing the same man two different times, but with the same purple hoodie each time. We really want the community's help. We know somebody has some detail. No details too small. Phoenix PD says investigators have hit a wall. They need help. And Monique needs to know who killed her son. I just want somebody, anybody to come forward with any information, no matter what it is, no matter how small it may seem. If you recognize this guy or know anything about the shooting, call Phoenix Police. William Pitts, 12 News.